Well, the California State Colleges have always been noted throughout their history for uh, engaging in educational innovation, and uh, I think this is uh, characteristic of uh, this type of activity. This is the first educational television station to be established at a state college. Would you say this is the forerunner of similar stations at other state colleges? I would certainly hope so. I think educational television has uh, a considerable future uh, in the state colleges. As you know, we have uh, already uh, established uh, several programs and uh, we already possess a certain amount of equipment in this area. We're teaching in many phases of educational television. And uh, one of the things we hope to do is to expand our uh, television communications uh, within the system. Uh, this station certainly uh, is a key uh, keystone to anything that we would uh, hope to, uh, to hope to attempt in, in the line of expansion. Governor Ronald Reagan last week expressed his opposition to a report which called for the setting up of a statewide network of educational television facilities. Could this slow down the development of ETV? Well, I'm afraid I can't comment on that because uh, all I know about it is what I have read in the newspapers. And uh, uh, my assumption is that uh, uh, the governor was uh, considering the fiscal implications of the Educational Television Advisory Committee's recommendation, but uh, I would have no comment on that because I don't know anything about it up to this point. Now with the advent of Channel 15, we can look forward to a tremendously uh, clear signal throughout the San Diego city and county area for us. How large is your potential audience of students? Well, this past year we've had a potential audience of 226,000 students, and now next fall we're projecting uh, over 250,000 students will be able to receive the uh, instructional television programs. Recent surveys in the Los Angeles market, which are probably reasonably valid here, show about 47% of the television homes have UHF capability. My guess, George, is that a, one of our problems is that many people have UHF and don't know it. Any set purchased in the last three years has UHF. Virtually all color sets have UHF. And so many people have the capability of receiving the picture. In most areas, not very much has appeared on UHF so far.